coolest dog of the day award goes to this guy. Happy Friday, everybody. <laughs> yeah, what she said. We're heading out to New Smyrna Beach. We're gonna catch a sunset uh, for what we can see because New Smyrna Beach on the East Coast, sunset's on the West Coast, but can see it a little bit and uh, walk the beach a little bit and get something to eat. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, we're out here at New Smyrna Beach now, Flagler Avenue. There is the sole. Everyone's asking how I like it so far. I actually was not that big of a fan the first week, but I am slowly but surely falling in love with it. I actually like the way it looks. It's got enough kick. It's just got the 2.0 engine, and I'm enjoying that car now. Dead Man's Wharf, yo. Everyone's gathered out here for the sunset. No cars on the beach right now. It's so incredibly windy. This might be the musical montage piece. That does it for our walk on the beach. It's pretty quick today. The sun is going down too quick. I have six eggs. Nice. This is what Mary's concerned about Pokemon. I know. I think we're gonna try to eat at the garlic at a new Smyrna. We haven't been out here before, but apparently the Jakatas have. Well, for as nice as this place looks, and we've wanted to get here for a bit, um, the line to get in was way too long, so we are skipping and heading elsewhere. We'll come back though. Someday. <laughs> All right, we scrapped going on the garlic, so now we're on Canal Street. We're gonna go to Yellow Dog Eats. This is the new Smyrna version of the place that's also in Gotha, right by Universal Studios. The menus are only slightly different. Mary got ahi tuna, tacos. This is the Club Elvis, pork, gouda, bacon, onion slices. Yellow Dog was good. It's uh, probably like half the size of the menu of the other one that's in Orlando. Yes. Food is good, but it's kind of the servers and everybody kind of have that beach attitude here where everything's a little bit more laid back. Mm -hmm. Could be a little bit slower. We were in a little bit more of a Anticipation yeah. rush by 8.30 at night, ready to eat my arm. <laughs> by the way, if you still play this game and you live over towards this area, you go to the beach, 
Look at this block. It's just non-stop. You can walk up and down this block all night. The moon is crazy tonight. It looks amazing. Zoom is not far enough to be able to show everybody, but take my word for it. Very Halloween-y. And we're back home. Um, it's going to be a little bit of a shorter video today. Um, wasn't a lot to do necessarily um, at, at the beach other than walk around the beach with the wind blowing around and you guys couldn't really hear anything. So we have to kind of take the sound out and cycle it in with some background music for you guys so that we're not hearing about headphones being destroyed and everything. And then we really couldn't film all that much at Yellow Dog um, because we sat at the bar. It was packed and... A little bit difficult to film when you have two people sitting on either side of you and everything too. And so just to give folks um, time check, it's actually about 10 o'clock at night now in any event. Um, so I need to go find clothes to wear for tomorrow. Um, tomorrow, um, and I trust me, I don't want um, notes below about sympathy for, for me and everything, but um, my best friend that I've known since um, third grade um, has been in other videos with us before. Um, but his mom uh, passed away this week, so she was kind of like a mother or second mother to us growing up also. So, I mean, it's kind of been, um, you know, we grew up in Flushing, Queens. Um, they moved out to Staten Island. I moved out to Staten Island. I moved to Orlando. They moved to Orlando. Um, so, a um, little bit of a rough week between work, being sick, and um, everything happening there. So, um, trust me, like I said, um, it, I don't want notes of sympathy for me because I know uh, my friend actually needs me there tomorrow. So tomorrow's funeral in the morning. It's going to be a very long day. Um, I anticipate uh, we may go to the Universal um, event, the Pass Holder event tomorrow night. I'm not positive about that either um, because what I can see from the folks that are going there tonight, it almost seems like it's just like extra magic hours for a Disney park. I don't really see um, the selling point for going, but um, if we're up to it, we're going to go. But for now, I'm going to sleep after I get my clothes and iron them. So, thank you for all of your likes. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for your subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. We'll see you guys.